Hey guys, it's me, Seren, back with another video. Today is day six of Hidden Figures, and today's hidden figure is Maria P. Williams, who was a black American filmmaker, writer, and activist who wrote, produced, and acted in The Flames of Wrath in 1923, making her the first black American woman film producer. While few details are known about her early life, it is known that Williams was a Kansas City school teacher who gave up teaching in the 1890s to become an activist and political writer. Traveling through Kansas as a social activist and lecturer and giving politicized speeches on the topics of the day for black Americans, from 1891 to 1894, she was also the editor-in-chief of a weekly newspaper in Kansas City called The New Era. After The New Era shuttered, Williams began to edit and publish another newspaper called The Women's Voice, which focused on colored women's topics specifically. The women's voice ran from 1896 to 1900. Deciding to stay in Kansas City permanently and end her travels, Williams became active in politics in Missouri, publishing short pamphlets on political candidates and in 1916 writing a book on her political and social views titled My Work and Public Sentiment. 10% of the proceeds from her book were donated to criminal reform and crime suppression regarding black Americans. Williams was also an organizer and speaker for the Good Citizens League, an organization dedicated to lowering crime in black neighborhoods. In 1923, Williams wrote and produced The Flames of Wrath, which was a silent crime drama that she also starred in. In order to distribute the film, she founded the Western Film Producing Company and Booking Exchange with her husband, Jesse L. Williams. The Williamses also started and owned several other small businesses in Kansas City, Missouri, and used their Western Film Producing Company to put out silent films for the local Black American audience. Maria's husband, Jesse, also operated a local motion picture theater as the general manager, while Maria served as the assistant manager. After releasing The Flames of Wrath, she was written about in the Norfolk Journal and Guide as follows. Kansas City is claiming the honor of having the first colored woman film producer in the United States. The Flames of Wrath, a mystery drama in five reels, written, acted, and produced entirely by colored people. This is what they think we mean when they say POC. As she was well known for giving aid around Kansas City, in January of 1932, Maria Williams was called to assist a stranger who claimed he had a sick brother at home. Unfortunately, she was found shot dead on the side of the road soon after, and sadly, her murder remains unsolved. Many community members believed that her murder was related to her community activism. Maria P. Williams, first black woman film producer and a hidden figure. It's wild out here, y'all, when you're black women doing things. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. There will be links in the description box. Um, there's not a ton of information about her early life, but there is quite a bit written about her political activism and her film career. So please make sure you guys check those links out. So food for thought as always. Hopefully you guys are enjoying this week's Hidden Figures. See you next time. Peace.